All the levels are looking good. We have to watch the level of this pool every day to overflow there. There's no water on the floor, so that's good. The Gunch is out. Look at him. Oh, big old boy. Hey, you can actually see him grow. Jerry? Where you at, Jerry? Where you at? Oh, well. I don't see him. But I, I want to check out things over here. Look at all the sand they busted up. <laughs> see the African arrow? Push out this sand? Look at all these guys. And my favorite little view of Vegas over there. Wow. And every time I come out here to check out this tank, I end up staring at it for quite a while. You're getting big. How big you are? You're about eight inches long. Oh, so are you. Oh, you guys are really growing out here. There's some of our bigger loaches that are hopping about. See how these puffers over here. Oh yeah. Oh there you are. Hi. Aren't you a happy looking little guy? Where's your buddy at? Where's your other one at? He's hiding from me. I don't see him. Oh, he's right there. Hi. You're gonna be little chubby little guys. You're growing quick though. Jerry went off to. And here's another tank I can't stop looking at. Look at these guys. Oh, and you got the cutest little Fly River turtle. He's so cute. And you got these albino rays. It looks like someone's biting on you. So there's a male in here trying to breed with you. Amazing. Probably the guy back there. I can't see any other big enough. But maybe the albino. It's just amazing. See, I'm a pearl rays, but that's an albino black diamond. And look at that pattern on him. Oh, excuse you. <laughs> Look at this guy. They're growing quite quick. Another girl. And then this guy's getting huge. So I end up looking over here and watching over here. <sighs> Might be time to move you over. To the big tank over there. Or the other rays. These guys just kill me. So bright. She's gonna make remarkable babies. Yeah, we're talking about you. Okay, so here's what I'm figuring. My hand is here, so she's about 14, 15 inches maybe, 14 inches. So she's able to go over here now. We got all these guys over here. 
Ouch. No, that was definitely bigger, but this is just a little bit bigger than him. Or her. And this one, this one's actually smaller than her, so we can bring her, bring her over here now. Look at you guys. They're all on top of each other. They think it's feeding time. You guys are amazing. Look at you. That's Black Diamond with the Thousand Island trait. Look at the color of the black and white of these two. So bright. And you're a good color too. All black like that. Dark as can be. And you are just amazing too. Man, I look at every one of these and just it just amazes me. I remember a long time ago, I'd be hunting for them, you know. I want a black diamond. I want a black diamond. And, uh, you know, now I own some exquisite creatures here. And uh, they just don't even feel right. It's like it's uh, a dream or something. They're just beautiful. There's another one over here. A couple over here. What are you guys doing? Come on. <laughs> Alright, let's move on. And you know what else is neat? Is every time I come out here, there's more fish out here. Since I'm not in charge of taking the fish in no more, Jerry handles it and Josh handles it. I don't know what's coming in and going out, so I have to leave it up to them completely now. And every time I come out here, I find more and more fish that I haven't seen before. That big marble. You're going in the 4400, buddy. There's a tiger shovel nose mixed with a marble cat. Iridescent sharks. And that's another one. Tiger shovel nose mixed with the marble cap. And there's a the tiger shovel nose. What else we got here? Yeah, you're a big boy. We got an alligator gar up here. More iridescence, more plecos. Yeah, you're a big boy. Red tail down here. And then I come over here. And I have to look at my pair, Eva. Look at you. Look at your skin. Nice. You're a beautiful fish. Got that translucentness to them. It's just beautiful. Awesome. Look how long his fins are. Or his uh, tentacles. Yes, and that's that lungfish that came in with his whole back of his body all tore up. He's all, all healed up now. You can see it's growing out now. There's a peacock bass. Oh, we got pike in here. Clown knives. More plecos. Of course, he's been here for a while. And over here, there's always something Killing the belly cats. There's some cichlids in there. Big pleco. Cigar barbs. Tinfoil barbs. Silver dollars. Kissing garami. Huh. So yeah, I come out here for a minute and I end up spending an hour out here just looking at things. Like, ooh, and ah. <laughs> I know it's silly, but you can still get thrilled by your own fish. I don't know. It just seems like a, it's, it's more like a public aquarium here than anything else. They have a knife. Kills me how he hides his head and he thinks no one can see him. 
<sighs> and the big lungfish seems to be getting along out fine out in here. Flag tail. There's the Giardini. The BATF. Oh, what happened to someone? Oh, this albino iridescent. Somebody had you in their mouth. Look at your skin tore up under your mouth. Somebody had your head in their mouth. Who could it be? Might be the lungfish. Might be the big bite. You I doubt that, though. I'd say it would have to be the lungfish in here. We're going to have to move one of them. Look at you. You lost your eye and everything. Oh, no. Oh, my goodness. Look at you. You're all tore up. You poor thing. Oh, my goodness. Can you imagine the pain he went through? This had to happen last night. It wasn't like that yesterday. Look at this. Oh, man. What happened there? One of the fish had him in his mouth. Poor little guy. These are the tragic things that happen and you have no control over. I wouldn't have thought nothing about, you know, I would have thought the lungfish, if he was going to go after anything, would go after the smallest biter. So I told Josh to get him out of here anyway because the biter's too small. But this guy's a lot bigger and thicker. Look how messed up he is. Oh, poor dude. Can you imagine the amount of pain he went through? Getting his eye ripped out like that and having his head in another another guy's mouth. Usually they go up to like the long fish's legs too. I mean that's a nice little easy target there. Wow. That's terrible. Well, it's what, three o'clock? Josh will be here at four. I'll have him move it today. Unbelievable. Alright, and then even just walking through the pool room to uh see the fish. I have to always come back here. I have to always look at my 540 and see my Australian lungfish in there. And then I get caught up looking in here because Brutus and Bruiser always comes over, thinks we got food. See, somebody said that the cichlid population went way down, and it sure has not. There are cichlids everywhere. If you can see by uh, our turtle cam yesterday from the last video, there were cichlids everywhere under there. So, see, there's Brutus. What's up, buddy? And when you got a six foot plus fish sitting around, you gotta stop and look at them. You gotta check them out. And the big old fat Niger down there. Oxidorus Niger. Some people call it ripsaw catfish. Now there's the iridescent shark. Where's the prune sharks? They're cruising around here somewhere. There comes one here. Yeah, that's the, that's a prune shark. You can tell by the tip of their top fin. The iridescent don't have that point to it. I love how he's got all that blue color on him too. So this guy here, pointed. That's a prune. That's an iridescent shark. There's Bruiser too. Another iridescent. I gotta get in there and spread all this gravel out so it's covering the ground again. I hope you like the way uh the video with the uh, the amazement and the wonder that we still have. I uh, hope you guys appreciate it. And, uh, of course, this is what, uh, this is going to be Monday's video. Uh, Wednesday, Josh has a video. And then uh, I'll be back Friday. So until then, stay fishy, my friends.
Well, just a little extra video at the end here. I just wanted to show you guys the laziest fish we have. There it is. <laughs> you're supposed to be out here working. You're out here sleeping. I'm working. I'm, I'm watch, I'm you're working? I'm a fish sitter. You're fish sitting. <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, my God. I thought she was out here working this whole time. You have been? You look like it. You look like your, your job's rough. The guards are alive. They're fine or alive. All right, guys. You see what do we have to deal with here? All right, bye. <laughs>